Hey guys, the Dog Dog here, and welcome to the video. And before I start, I just want to say I'm sorry if I sound weird in this video. It's just that I've got a cold, and you know I I might sound a little weird, so I'm sorry. But yeah, let's get on to the invention we've got today. So as you can see in the chat right now, um, we've actually got um some messages from uh, GLaDOS, which um, is basically the invention that I made today. So for anyone who doesn't know where this comes from, you really, 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 really have to play Portal 2. Because this is based off uh, a game series called Portal, um, specifically the second game, Portal 2, and it is one of my all-time favourite games. And, um, spoiler alert, I guess, uh, the main character, one of the main characters, um, GLaDOS gets put, is a robot and she gets put into a potato um, by the other robot, Wheatley. One of the other robots, Wheatley. And it, it's just such an amazing game. I'll talk about that another time though. Today I'm going to talk about the invention we've got today. So basically, uh, this wouldn't have to like particularly be GLaDOS like it is. Um, this could be any character really, but I've just done it as GLaDOS. And basically what it means is that Every so often, while you're carrying GLaDOS in your inventory, GLaDOS will say some quote from the game. So we've got um, eight quotes here, so each of these command blocks, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then eight over there. Um, they are all quotes from the game. Um, that one doesn't actually have her name, I've just realised, <laughs> which is a bit of a bit of a problem there. But um, I'll fix that in a minute. Basically, yeah, this little system could be used for any character. So I was going to do some other characters, but I just really like the concept of this. Um, so it's a poisonous potato, and yes, you can accidentally eat this if you are in survival mode. So I guess that's kind of a bad thing. But, oh well, um, obviously this still works in survival mode. So this isn't really useful, it's just a funny little thing, and it might be useful in a Portal 2 uh, adventure map, or some kind of Portal adventure map. But it's really funny. So uh, let's just go through and look at how this thing basically works. And I just broke it by pick picking up that piece of redstone. So uh, basically here we have a randomizer. So we have a, um, a dropper that will shoot out items into a cobweb, and depending on where they are, they'll take a different time to drop down. When this trip wire is powered this dispenser will fire out another uh, item and will also power this torch here so that means that every so often a random amount of time um, you guys saw in that little intro like part where I was showing off the thing um, how roughly how often it says things but yeah um, so that that will change the time slightly so it's not every like 30 seconds exactly oh and by the way this command block just gives um, gives GLaDOS's this command block here will test if they have a GLaDOS potato in their inventory and uh, oh, also this has a little thing so it says GLaDOS Potato S which is the name of it in the game developed by Wheatley Labs and basically as you can see um, there I took the uh, potato out of my inventory and it turned off um, so if I threw this out uh, that torch will turn on and that comparator will turn off and it doesn't just work with normal poisonous potatoes I think I hope <laughs> Um, yeah, so you can see there, it doesn't just work with normal poisonous potatoes, it has to actually be the ones that are GLaDOS. So yeah, that will then turn this torch off. We then have a simple angle gate here, which basically goes into a bunch of randomizers, which all go into the, um, the command blocks. So basically, the way I'm getting it to look like an actual character, so if you see, I say, um, hey GLaDOS, then, oh, I can't spell, <laughs> then uh, you see the Dougie Dug Dug, um, and then the uh, the message uh, with like a space between that too. So it looks exactly as if there was a character in the game called GLaDOS saying these messages, which is why I really like how it works. Um, also, if we, I think I picked up the item again, haven't I? Yeah. If we take this cobweb out, she will just repetitively say things. Uh, or she won't. <laughs> I don't know why that didn't work then. Um, let me throw another item into there. So now she'll just uh, basically repetitively say things over and over again. And yeah, as you can see, if I send a message, it looks kind of, it looks just like a actual person was saying the message. I don't know why that broke. I think that's just lag for me recording. But yeah, so it's a pretty simple system. It wouldn't have to be uh, Potato S Glados character um, like specifically. Uh, I just thought it was a really cool example to show off this kind of speech bot type thing that I created. Uh, using command blocks. Do leave a like, a comment, and subscribe if you did enjoy, um, and thank you for watching.